My name is Svetlana. I'm 19. That makes it two years since I got here. All that I wanted was a chance in life. But I trusted the wrong guy. He spoke so kindly with me. I was convinced that I was my chance to get my family out of poverty. I was wrong. How I miss normal days, without pain, without evil. How I miss to be truly loved and respected. But that is just a memory now. I feel guilty. I lost my dignity. Every day I die a bit. Am I condemned to die here? Sad and alone? I hope not. Since I got here, my day starts and ends disgusting. In the place that I live, disgusted by the people that I have to see every day, that abuse me and treat me as an animal, I'm really scared of them. Please help me. I can't trust anyone here. By the way, they don't deserve to be called people. They are monsters. But I'm still loving life. Deep in my heart, I know that there's something else out there. I'm placing all my hope in this tape for real. I remember my daddy's voice murmuring to my mommy that life was too hard. Yes, it is true. It is hard to raise four kids. Sometimes we didn't have enough food. Even though, if I could choose, I would go back there and starve to death if necessary. It would be worth it. I never imagined myself being trafficked for the sex market. This is probably the tenth brothel that I've been and it's only getting worse. In the few hours that I have to sleep in this place, dirty, stinky and so cramped, I do two things. One is cry. You know, release every single drop that I hold during the day. I can't stand that anymore. Please, believe me. The second thing is to ask myself, what have I done to deserve such a life? Can they see some value in me? No, no, no. I'm not talking about the few bucks that they pay the Russian bastard to humiliate me for long as they want. You don't know how much pain he causes me. He came every morning to check me out. I'm so afraid. He's always threatening me. He often says that I owe money to him and that is the reason that I need to sell my body. I'm telling you that I'm not for sale. It is good that you are awake. We have a special client today, and you better please him. He has a lot of money. Get ready. I dream of the day that you are going to do something to save me. If you can hear my voice, please come. about moving to another brother tomorrow. Please do something today. I'm telling you, I'm not for sale.